What's up, what's up, what's up, Dinner for Life Fish, your girl Shay, and today we're back with another video. Okay, so um, I put it on Facebook, I put it on Instagram, I put it on Twitter, um, and I put it on Snapchat. So the question was, um, guys and ladies, what is something that you are afraid to ask your partner? It's a good question, and most YouTubers are doing it. I've seen a couple of them do it. So, yeah. So, I wanted to be the one to do it, too. Well, let's do it next. So, yeah. So, basically, um, for example, why do females go in the bathroom with a group of girls? Um, Sometimes, you know, if we go to a club or we party and stuff like that. If the bathroom is trifling or nasty, you want somebody to hold your belongings. Sometimes every style don't have, like, one of them little hooks or something like that. To hold your stuff or hold your, your hair if you got to throw up. Um, just be, you know, protective because you're drunk. You know, you want to still be protective. Um, you can comment down below what y'all think. So, I'm going to ask again. Um, for example, why do females need a group of females to go in the bathroom with them when they, like, at the club? Even at the restaurant, you know. And sometimes, I'm, I'm seeing another one, taking pictures as well. But, yeah, questions pop up at the bottom of the screen so y'all can see. So, y'all won't forget when y'all comment down below. Next question, um, was... How do you know when your partner is cheating? Mm -hmm. Think for a minute. Okay, so the first question I got was, I got this on Instagram. Um, somebody said, while texting. Um, I should ask for explanation or ask for what 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 that mean because in my in my eyes I say as far as how that I guess she's trying to say it was a, it was a female I guess she's trying to say how they be texting slow or texting fast to you or how the the move change I guess that's what she's trying to say I don't know but I, I'm guessing that's what she she meant the next the next answer was. Um, when they always, well, this is right from a man, so he, he basically let us know what he did. I'm just playing. <laughs> so basically he said, when they always um, work late, but when it's time to pay them bills, or them car notes, or them phone bills, or lights and stuff like that, the checks don't add up with the time he was coming home from work. So that's what the man said. The, the other lady, she put phone. Phone, I would say, what's I could say? Lock, um... Um, hiding the phone every time, every, every time you turn around, they got the phone like this, or you turn around, they got the phone like this, or they had the phone trying to protect the sleep bad, you know, lay bad, you know, it's always bad when you look up the phone bad, you know, stuff like that. So, that could be cheating as but that, that could be, you know, cheating as one. That's what we're talking about. Cheating, that could be cheating as one. So, yeah, that's all I have on here. I'm going to I'm gonna read y'all a fruit of my notes that I took down. I have, yeah, I have my little book. But I'm going to read y'all a fruit of my notes that I took down. Um, and I, and, and okay, so I watched this, this show, which y'all probably know is called the Steve Harvey Show. Um, he talks real good on that show. Like, he gives you relationship tips, marriage tips, um, friendship tips, baby mama tips, baby daddy tips, girlfriend, you know, boyfriend. He gives y'all... If you look for some good advice and good examples, stuff like that, watch the Stevie Harvey Morning Show. Because that show be busting. Not, not to even try to hop it up more, but I watched that show yesterday and I got blow. Like, my man was blow. Like, I got so much information, so much tips, so much, look, you know, little quotes. I got so much stuff. But I'm going to read one thing that this um lady said on his show. Y'all probably know it. Y'all probably don't know it, but I'm going to read it. It say, this lady asked... She asked Steve Harvey, and the title what well, the title of it is Lairway. She asked it's for as far as ladies. She um asked Steve Harvey. She said, "Men's are putting women on Lairway. Listen carefully. You know how you like you go to a store, um, and you you see something that you want, but you're not gonna get it right now, so you're gonna put it on Lairway. Catch what I'm saying? It's like you know it's a little mess. It's too bad, but you put it on Lairway. Um, you don't get it." When you want it as fast. Put it on level to that you don't want nobody else to get it. So you put it on level. Um, and you don't want to lose it. You don't want to lose that person. Don't, don't go thinking about clothes and shoes. Some other person. So um, nobody else to, to, to get it. Um, so you put it on level. You can um, you can check, you check up on a girl. 
making sure she oh making you make making man you making sure your leg way okay making sure she's straight making sure she good you go look a couple tens couple twenties couple hundreds you just you know make sure that she's there trying to keep her you know occupied and basically stuff like that um make sure that the Make sure that the meal and stuff like that is taken care of. Making sure that the ba- I mean that she okay, she good. Like you know the person that they dating on the live with. So you making sure they good. Make sure they held done. Make sure they nails done. They they, they got clothes and stuff like that. Shoes or anything like that. And then all of a sudden comes up and you's like, you like you know all of a sudden come up. He he not only with just you, but he's only he like he was with he was, he was, he's with multiple women. And it's like. He finally, pick, you know, finally make a decision and say, okay, I don't want to be with her no more. You know, Mandy, she was on level. I don't want to be with her no more. Let, let, let me let her know and let me go to the next person. You see what I'm saying? So the question was, how do men think it's okay to put women on level? That's a good question. That's a good, anybody can answer that. If you have anybody can answer that, you comment down below. Why do men feel like it's okay to put women on level? You comment down below with your answer and what do you think? Oh, you know what do you think about it? What do you think? You know, far as you know, far as the question and stuff like that. Um, Steve said, in which I agree with Steve. He said, "Don't let a man put you on layaway. Whether you know whether you down from one, you know one day to see that any any anywhere go, pick yourself back up. You know who you are. You see what I'm saying? So so don't let a man or anybody." downplay you, down talk you, you ain't this you know, you are somebody. Um you you know you are gonna be something you are something that you know you are gonna be something in life, become something better in life. Um you know you have goals, careers, you know what I'm saying? Reach for your dreams, reach for your goals and stuff like that. Don't ever let a man talk you down or 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 talk you to defeat and stuff like that. You know, just know that God got you. No matter if it's a man or you know, no matter if if, if it's with a man or without a man, just know that God got you. That's all you have to put in your mind. Don't ever don't ever let a man down. Either if you get you gain a little weight, you know, and he don't like the little weight. Okay, either you gonna go to the gym together. But other than that, you know what I'm saying? Like, period. Like just like just like marriage, you take me for who I am. If I if I gain thirty pounds, three hundred pounds, you no know, thirty thirty more pounds, um, you with me. So other than that, you have to take it or leave it. Or, or we both be going to the gym together. Period. That's how it go. So whether you like it or not, I'm not gonna always be this. You know how some girls are thick, some girls are slim, some girls are skinny. You know I'm not gonna always be skinny, slim, thick. I'm gonna gain you know a few pounds. You know, cause no, you know, cause, cause if you give somebody, you get happy. You get happy. It's something called happy weight. You gain extra pounds or you lose extra pounds, but you gain this kind of happy. This um, this kind of um, happy weight. Um, one more question, and I'm out of here. So the next one is go fishing. So basically, it's like men hunt. That's basically what Steve Harvey was. It's still Steve Harvey. It's best what he was saying. Men hunt. So how 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 men's fan women they hunt. That's their nature. That's them. That's what they do. They hunt women. So I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Oh, he hunt me. Oh, he. They hunt. They. They. They are assigned. They are made to hunt women. That is true. I'm not going to sit here and say they don't know. They hunt women. They just like they looking, searching. You know, they hunt women. So he. So so Steve called it go fishing. So comment down below. If, uh, comment down below if you have a a good example of go fishing slash hunting as a man. Um. Okay, so basically, Steve was saying that some men just go fishing and just end up with any chicken head. They just end up with anybody with no brain. But all, all they basically looking at is the body, the booty, um, not even that. They're not looking at if she know how to cook, if she potential, um, if she had a head on her shoulder. Is she trying to do something with her life? Is she trying to do something with her career? Is she trying to start a career? You know, so men look at females differently. They look at the booty. Oh, I'm a do do do. That's not what. That's not. You know what I'm saying? So get you somebody. Get, for us females, get y'all somebody that's. You know, even if they. You, it's not always about looks. Okay, it's not always about looks. Get you somebody with a the hell they shoulder, smart potential, trying to save, trying to stack their money up with you. Trying to, you know, be there for you and stuff like that. Don't get you nobody. You're going, okay, he cute, he fan. That's somebody that's going to be there for you, care for you, love you for you, no matter what. Period. Like, that's going to sit by your side. It's going to fight for you thick and thin, no matter what. Um. Okay, let's see. I'm not going to do no more. So, if y'all want more 
comment down below. Let me know if y'all y'all want me to talk about stuff like this more. But I well we do. I'm, I'm gonna sit here and say we don't. We do have um a event coming out, which I have an event coming up. Um and the date and stuff is is not renewed. The details not renewed, so I'm thinking about. So we're thinking about doing an event, as far as um relationship, and then and then my event. People don't know that my event is based off a book. My book. So people think, oh, what what do that mean? So my name, my book is called Open Book. That's why my event. That's that's why my event is called Open Book, cause I have everything in this book. Everything that I've been through, went through, as far as relationships, as far as friendships. Anything is in this book, so that's why I'm basically doing my open book event because I have a lot of stuff I want to share and some. Not even that I'm going because I, you know, sometimes you know you you need advice yourself. You know what I'm saying? So you don't always think, oh, well, I'm going to help everybody else. No, so sometimes you need help yourself. You can't always say, oh, I'm going to no. So sometimes you you know you want to sit down and be fed too, you know, and get help on your own. You can't always think that oh, well, I know all the answers. No, I do not. I want some of y'all answers to some of y'all, you know, all that stuff like that. Good, you know, good ideas, good examples. So yeah, so um, be posted, be looking out for that. And another thing is, if y'all want me to start my own YouTube channel, not like you know, as far as just me. If y'all want to see my morning routines, my night routines, um, me doing makeup, me talking about more relationship stuff, um, my career. Um, my goals, my stuff like that, and like more of my closet tours, um, stuff like that. Comment down below and let me know. Let me know because I I have a lot of stuff that I don't mind sharing with people. Like if it can if it help me, I don't mind, I don't mind helping nobody else. That's basically how I look at things in life. If the situation that I done went through, been through, and I learned from it, I don't mind helping nobody else that's going through it or that went through it. You know what I'm saying? I don't mind I don't mind helping people. Because you know, point of time everybody couldn't everybody at the time didn't get help. Didn't have help. So you know what I'm saying? So it's always good to, you know, get get with somebody that's trying to help, that's trying to be there for you and love you for you. You see what I'm saying? That's why I say don't just hook up with anybody or anything. You see what I'm saying? Because any, you know, some men is just, they'll be like, I'm with you for this, you know, amount of months, and then after they're gone. You know what I'm saying? So, be mindful of things, be careful, stuff like that. So, if y'all want me to start my own personal channel, y'all want to see me do a lot of stuff, and it's just me, not me and the Barbie. It's just me by myself. So, if y'all want to see that, comment down below and let me know. Because I don't mind giving y'all good advice and y'all giving me advice too. And we can talk about, you know, girl stuff, or stuff like that. And, you know, all stuff like that. And our channel is at, woo, I just posted, so it's right there. Our channel is at that. I'm so happy that we is at that. <laughs> let me stop playing. But... Yeah, and I've learned a lot from Nick and King, from Carmen and Corey, um, who else I can say? Funny Mike and Jaleel, um, who else I watch? That's about it. I watch Carmen and I can watch Carmen and Corey, Nick and King all day. Yo, I love you guys. Be blessed. Stay warm, because it's cold. It's getting colder and colder. Stay warm. I just won't be here without you guys.